now have greetings from Darian Allen, our senior class president. Good morning to parents, families, and friends of graduates, administrators, teachers and faculty, and finally, the baddest class to walk holes in. Today we are here to celebrate 13 years of hard work done by amazing athletic and academic students here today. It's amazing to see how our class has grown together in every aspect of the school through the mighty Blue Wave marching band, through our dazzling dolls drill team, through our pep cheer cheerleading team, to the outstanding and fantastic choir, and through student council who worked hard as always, through the honors of National Honor Society, and more. The class of 2012 will always have this special bond that won't be broken because we're a class that faced adversity with a powerful fist of Panther Park. No one thought, no one thought or even believed in us that our girls would make it to state or even to the playoffs in track, basketball, powerlifting. And no one thought, no one thought about this. No one thought our football team but guess what? Our class pulled together and faced obstacles by supporting our academic leaders, Tolanique and Kim and Nick, and our athletic leaders, Robin, Asia, Shay, Asia Rose, Trey, Joe, Malamo, the Payne brothers, Burrell, and others. I am honored to have served as your class president for the past two years, and I am even happier to tell everyone here today about the finest class to ever walk Clifton Jails. You guys are my friends, my pride, and my heart. Ladies and gentlemen, the class of 2012 welcomes you to our graduation ceremony. Those who search too hard may never achieve the happiness they desire. 
and those who live their life with optimism and appreciation discover happiness. As I stand here before you all, I would like to remind us that as we enter the real world and set goals for ourselves, let us remember what makes us happy. Speaking of seniors, this is the day we all have been waiting for. Time has gone by so quickly. I can remember the first day I entered Ozen as a freshman. I don't know about you all, but I was a nervous wreck. As the years progressed, we all have lost and gained some friends. Sadly, after today, we are all going separate ways, while some may keep in touch, others we may never see again. This is the last time we will ever be together as a class. But don't be sad about leaving because we have made many memories together in throughout our high school years. I would like to take a moment to expressly thank the few who made my memories extra memorable. My best friends, Angelica, Victoria, and Darius. You all made my years at Ozen very special, and I am truly thank you guys for being in my life. I remember all the moments we shared our laughs, tears, and jokes. Special thanks go out to my heart, home, my brothers, and especially my sisters, my Indian. You guys were always there for me, and I know that. until everything is just right. There are, it will never be perfect. There will always be challenges, obstacles, and less than perfect conditions. Mark Victor Hansen. I am Tolanique Jacobs, class band Victorian. To the members of the Beaumont Independent School Board, administration, teachers and staff of Ozan High School, parents, family, and friends, I would like to welcome you to the graduation of the 2012 class of Ozan High School. Before I wrote that Ozan, the community and media portrayed a negative picture of Ozan. At first, I did not want to come to Ozan because of what my friends were saying and what I was hearing. Then, I realized how in the world I was going to let someone else decide what school was best for me. <laughs> Ozan is the best school in Beaumont ISD. because Ozan produces productive people, but some looking in from the outside would not know that. <laughs> Parents, if this is your first time showing up at an Ozan event, then you have missed four good years. The students here at Ozan reflect character, humor, intelligence, and talent. If you still have a student at Ozan, your involvement during this time is crucial to student success. If your last child is graduating today, I know you cannot wait until he or she walks across stage, not because your child, not because your child will be graduating, I know you'll be thinking about that party you'll throw for yourself. But truly, this precious time is the ending of one phase of life and the beginning of another. So please, treasure this time with your graduate. To my classmates of 2012. I, I, I don't have to say good job to y'all because y'all already know what you did. Yet, from here on out, life is what you make of it. 
However, remember to respect each other and most importantly, your actions. Today, it, it doesn't matter if you're ranked number one or 278, we're now striving for the same outcome, which is to be successful individuals. Do not let anyone tell you who you're going to be or what you're going to become. Pursue your dreams and your goals. Pursue in what you believe in and not what you know. There are many opportunities for us, and I want to see the class of 2012 get a piece of our success. We are our own future. Our parents have raised us to the best of their ability. Now it's time for us to be better than our, what our parents were. I want us to be able to say, that professional athlete, that was my classmate from Ozan. That doctor, that was my classmate from Ozan. That president, that was my classmate from Ozan. All of us, remember stories, messages, or quotes we have received from parents, teachers, families, and others. So I will end my address by sharing with you my mom's repeated message, my sister and I. I'll be honest, it, it took me a while to fully understand the meaning of her words, but she told us, I will not take credit for your successes, nor will I be blamed for your failures. Which means, if you succeed and fail or life, it is completely up to you. You cannot blame anyone else but yourself if you are not who you want to be or where you want to be. However, if you are content with who you are, where you live, or what you do, then do not blame the world because you are not happy with what you have become. It all comes down to which route you take and if you take them. Classmates, there is nothing standing in your way but time. So let us get out there and be productive because Ozan produces productive people. I'm Tolnik Atlantis Jacobs, and in seven years from now, I, you can say, Tolnik Jacobs, that lawyer, that's my classmate from Ozan. Thank you and congratulations. Mr. Woodrow Reach Board President, members of the Bowman Independent School District Board of Trustees, Dr. Carol A. Thomas, Superintendent of Schools, and members of the Superintendent's Cabinet, parents, guardians, relatives, friends, and patrons of Clifton Jail and Magnet High School. The outstanding class of 2012 is the 13th graduating class from Clifton Jail and Magnet High School. This class boasts 72 honor graduates, 14 magnum cum laude graduates, and 58 cum laude graduates with four early graduates. They have accumulated 2.2 million in scholarships via academics, athletics, and the military. Many of the graduates were in the Pegasus Honors Program. Dual credit graduates have accumulated 130 hours. Many students are actively involved in reaping the benefits of scholarship from our enrichment programs. Accomplishments is the middle name of 2012. They magnify what BISD represents. Talented, high achieving students and staff who exceed state standards and are the blueprint for districts around the country. These young people are state champions in girls track, finalists in girls basketball, perennial volleyball participants, national and state powerlifting champions, regional finalists in boys basketball, track and football, members both being state finalists in band solo and ensemble and twirling for four consecutive years state champions in vocational and technical arts for the last two years, a dance company of national prominence, 
Panther Productions, the heartbeat of communications for Beaumont Independent School District, and the flagship, the magnificent Clifton J. Ozan Magnet Choir, who carried the battle cry for Superintendent Carol Thomas and the school board that no child would be left behind. All facilities would be state-of-the-art and the pride of Beaumont and, and inspire optimally optimal performance for all students. The administration, faculty, and staff of Clifton J. Ozan High School are very proud of the graduating class of 2012 and would like to congratulate you on your many accomplishments. Dr. Thomas, it is my pleasure to announce that all seniors have met or will meet by August 2012 the educational requirements mandated by the Texas Education Agency and the Board of Trustees of the Beaumont Independent School District. Dr. Thomas, I present to you the graduating class of Clifton J. Ozan Magnet High School 2012. that I use the authority given to me by the state of Texas and by the Board of Trustees of the Beaumont Independent School District to accept the class of 2012 from Clifford J. Ozan High School and now declare you ready to receive your diploma. Congratulations. 